What's up, everybody? I feel like at this point, I should start making an intro for this channel, but for now, let me just fix the lettering. Okay. Hello! Oh my god, I'm out of breath now. <laughs> Okay, hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'll try to make an intro sometime soon. Okay, so for this YouTube video, we're going to be doing a Q&A. So I asked you guys on Twitter the other day um, to ask me some questions. And we'll... I, I got a few questions. Not many, but I got enough to make a video. So I posted this TikTok like two days ago, I believe. Um, it was in honor of 50k followers. Uh, thank you so much, guys. Honestly, um, we're currently at 100k, which is amazing. I, and I love you guys, every single one of you. And I'm so grateful. So yeah, I asked you guys on this video to comment some questions, and you guys did comment a few. Um, so I'll be answering them on this video today. Okay, let me just fix this a little bit. Okay, okay let's see what the first question was. Okay, so this question says... How do you get the face template you use? Can you make a video on where to find it? I actually got a lot of comments asking the same. These were just a few. So how do you get the mask? How do you get the template of the perfect face? So today, I'm going to show you guys how to get that temple. template. I don't know why I keep saying temple. Okay, so let's go to Safari real quick. Let's Google... Let me see, what did I Google? Um, golden base ratio. Let's see if that was what I Googled. Oh, this is one, <laughs> this is a funny. I, I saw this one and I was like, oh my God, that's so funny. And this is the one I used to use, the one where I did the Charlie one and it was just all messed up. People were saying, oh, that's not the right one. Oh, that's not the right one. So how to look for the right one. But let's see, where is the one that I'm currently using? Oh my God, where is it? Okay, yeah, um, I'm going to try a different search because that's just not working out. Mm, was it female? No, face ratio. Let's see what appears. I'm, I seem unable to remember what I searched, but don't worry guys. I'll find it. I'll find it. Uh, let's try looking for a female ratio, symmetrical face ratio. No. My God, what did I search? Yeah, it looks like this. Will, this is not working either. Let me see if I can find it, looking through, like, pictures. No. What the heck? What was that? That was weird. Girl. Let's see. Oh my god, what is it? I, I have a feeling that I searched something that had to do with female. Let's try let's try putting like female perfect 
they simply female. Okay, let's see if I can find it like this. Oh, here it is. Okay, so this is the one I'm using. Okay, so look guys, I actually couldn't find this template like without any background. So what I did is like I grabbed a picture and then like I I saved it to my photos. Okay, so once I had the picture saved, I went I went to procreate. Let me just erase this real quick. Okay, and I added the the picture. So what I did is like I switched the little thing that writes, the little brush to like really small. I made the brush really small and then I put it in black. So what I'm doing is I'm going to be tracing all the black lines. So that's what I did like for the template that I did for my other videos is I just traced. I got this um, grid and I traced it because I thought that was like, since I couldn't find it, I thought that was like the easiest way to get it. Look guys. Like when you trace it has to be in another layer because then you trace it and then you just... Okay, let me just trace a little bit. This is going to be some really bad tracing because this is just an example. And I'm going to do it real quick because actually tracing this, it took a while. Okay, so look, let me just remove the other layer and see how it's, that's just going to be by itself. And that's pretty much how I did it. That's how I got the grid. You can also try just erasing everything, but I really do think that's going to be more complicated. That's why I choose not to do it. That was going to be even more time consuming if I erased it. But I'm pretty sure erasing it would also work. Do not recommend, but it could work. So yeah, guys, that's how I got the template. My most asked question. <laughs> okay, so Mary RDC.94. And green hair girl ask, what app is this? By the way, love you. Oh my god, girl, I love you too. I love every single one of you guys. I'm so grateful. Okay, so what app is this? Bet you won't guess what app it is. It's Procreate, guys. I use Procreate. All the time. All the time. Every single thing. Every single thing that I do is going to be done with Procreate. Wait, give me a second. Procreate. Wait, give me another second. Procreate. <laughs> yes, guys. I use Procreate for everything. Um, Whatever I do. The symmetrical face thing. Look. You see? Everything's on Procreate. You can see it's Procreate right there in the corner. I use Procreate to do the little doodles. Um, I also use Procreate to do the um, perfect face check. Let me see if I have a perfect face check right here. I don't think I have one. No, I don't have them. Oh, I also use Procreate to remove um, Kim Kardashian's eyebrows. Yeah, um, I pretty much use Procreate for every single thing. That's the only app I have for editing, drawing, because I'm broke. I can't afford another app. So yeah, it's Procreate, guys. Always Procreate. So my last question is, Pet Naps ask, are you Swedish? Um, no, I'm not Swedish. Um, I don't know where uh, this person got that from. <laughs> Do I have a Swedish voice, guys? Um, um, no, I'm not Swedish. I am Mexican, American. I'm both. But yeah, no, not Swedish like at all. Not even a little bit. And mainly Mexican, like super Mexican. <laughs> Where's my Mexican family at, huh? Okay, let's erase this. Okay, by the way, um, before I end this video, I do want to make a quick disclaimer. Wait, that's how you spell disclaimer? Let me just double check real quick. Disclaimer. 
disclaimer. Oh, misspelled it. Disclaimer. Yeah, it looks like I didn't spell it right. D i s c l a i m e r. Am I missing the i? Oh, it looks like an l. I. You know what? I'm. I'm. I'm just gonna leave it like this. Whatever, guys. I don't know how to spell for everybody that comments on my videos because I had a few comments saying, "See, oh, not being able to spell." You, you know what? That is true. I can't spell, and I'm not ashamed about it. I should know how to spell, but I don't. Anyways, moving on. I did want to make a cute, disc uh, cute, <laughs> a quick disclaimer about my TikTok videos. I've seen some comments saying, um that I shouldn't be doing that because it makes people insecure, that I'm not doing it right, that I should stop, that I don't know how to Photoshop. I just want to say that the, all these videos I'm making are like, they're just a joke. Um, they're not meant, I don't, I don't make them to make people feel insecure about themselves. Um, the golden ratio is just, it's, if, if you fit or don't fit on the golden ratio is that doesn't make you perfect or not perfect because that thing doesn't measure people's perfection it's more about being symmetrical than being perfect or being beautiful or whatever um i do those videos as a joke obviously you guys noticed i do not know how to photoshop um if you've seen like the first one of my first videos that went viral, which was the one where I did Charlie, um, and I did her horribly, you can see that my photoshopping skills are like horrible. I'm barely doing. I guess I'm doing it kind of alright right now. I'm fully aware that I do not know how to Photoshop. I'm fully aware that the perfect face thing doesn't define a person's perfection because if you see in some of the videos you see how i got all the celebrities beautiful they're they were all beautiful and then i do the perfect face check on them and then they look all weird and funny and that's because the perfect face check is like it's just a scam guys it's not that grid it's not gonna define your perfection that's not gonna make you prettier I don't think anybody fits that perfectly. Um, so yeah, that's all I wanted to say to you guys. Um, yes, we... Oh! Oh, wait. He... Okay, right here. That's the template I was using, guys. Here you can see how... I just like drew over this person to get it and then I just put it in transparent and then I just go to share and I press the uh, PSD so I can save to my camera roll and that's how, that's how I got it um, yeah anyways um, I, I seem to get lost so much like I get lost in track. I'm, I don't know what I'm saying. So, yeah. Um, let me just show you a picture real quick. Uh, I'm lost. I'm really confused. Oh, okay. So, here's where I did the perfect face check on Ariana Grande. And... Well, as you can see, it's not perfectly done. Her eyes, her starters, they look weird. Is is the, it's just not it, guys. Um this is what the template views as perfect. Ariana Grande was way more prettier before I did all of this to her. That was. This is just an example, guys. I just want to. I just want to make this disclaimer pretty clear that just because you fit or don't fit into the perfect face check doesn't make you beautiful or ugly. Okay. 
that's it that that that's i'm gonna stop ranting right now <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching my videos, for hearing me just talk, 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 talk. And, uh, yeah, thank you so much for your support. Thank you for so much for 200 um, subscribers and for 100,000 followers on TikTok. I'm so grateful for all of you guys, and I love you. See you later. <laughs> Bye.